Welcome back to Ice Hawks TV. Joseph Zakszewski with you. Joined alongside Ice Hawks defenseman Adam Clendenning. And Adam, I know you have yet to return to Rockford, the town yet, but uh, it's been a nice welcome back to this organization for you since coming over in the, in the trade between the Blackhawks and the Arizona Coyotes. But, I mean, walk us through the return to this organization because it's been a couple of seasons and it would be nice to catch up with you. Yeah, it's uh, been a couple different places, but, um, you know, it's kind of funny how everything goes full circle. So, um, Great to be back, and you know this is a great organization. They treat their players very well. So, and what was the news? Oh, pardon me. What was the news of, of and how did you react when you knew that you were coming back to some familiar, familiar faces? I know you have a lot of friends and family and and fans that were excited to hear that uh, you were making the return to the Midwest. Yeah, um, yeah, I was a little shocked. I had no idea, um, but you know I know the staff really well, and um, you know the training staff, I should say, and the equipment guys. But um, I actually played with uh, Sheldon and. Um, heard nothing but great things about Jeremy, so um, you know I was excited and happy to be back. And then with that being said, you are coming into, I guess, a new face to this organization. Obviously, you were with the Rockford Ice Hogs uh, a few seasons ago, but the times have changed a little bit. You mentioned you actually played with Sheldon, and of course, Jeremy, a very young head yeah. coach as well. But I mean, what has been your first impressions of a of a new look Rockford Ice Hogs? Yeah, um, I mean, it's pretty similar to when I was here. Just a bunch of new faces, young team, and um, you know, a lot of speed, a lot of skill. Uh, so it kind of plays right into, I mean, there's the whole organization style of play hasn't changed. So um, it's just a bunch of new faces with new names, realistically. And then, of course, a lot of those new faces are youngsters. This is a very young lineup for this Rockford Ice Hog group. Also mixed in with some veterans like yourself, Cody Franzen. You also have Tanner Carroll floating around a little bit as well. But, I mean, what was uh, your first conversations like with some of these young guys that are, you know, even though it's the midway point of the season, but they're still trying to find their way a little bit? Yeah, yeah. Um Honestly, I haven't really spoke to many of them. I, I room with Radish, um, so I spoke to him a little bit, but um, everybody's really new to me. <laughs> um, I still can't like pick out names and numbers yet, so um, not too many conversations I have, I've had yet, but um, I'm sure over the next little bit we'll, we'll get that done. And now again, uh, catching up with you here, it's been a little while since you've been in Rockford, Illinois. What are you looking forward to the most in terms of returning to that town and the, and the Forest City community overall? Because I know uh, once the news hit that you were making your comeback, a lot of fans reached out and were just like, when's he getting into town? When do we see him again? And I know there's probably some familiar faces and places you want to visit as well. Yeah, um, I mean, they, they love the team, so um, I think that's a big part of it is playing in front of fans that really appreciate what you do and what you bring to the community. So. Um, you know, I learned that over my first couple of years here and um, got to know some people that, you know, maybe run restaurants or, um, you know, just season ticket holders that really appreciate what we do for, you know, maybe their kids or their families in general. So, um, you know, I think that's a big part of uh, our team and our approach as players. So, uh, you know, looking forward to get back at it. Catching up with defenseman Adam Clendenning. And Adam, now you're uh, wrapping up a tail end of a, what has been a lengthy road trip here. you got a game tonight against the Cleveland Monsters, a team that you just saw this past Wednesday and picked up a point in the shootout loss, unfortunately. But now uh, you're, you're joining this organization, trying to get them on the groove and they're continuing to climb up the Central Division. From what you've seen and what you've processed in the in the short amount of time here, what are you looking forward to and what are you looking to build off of going into these next couple games? Um, I think we, if we play our style of game and we're responsible with the puck and manage the game, um, we're very quick and we like to make plays and if they're there a lot of our guys are able to make the plays but I think it's being able to manage it not always trying to make something happen and I think that comes with maybe being a little young um, you know guys want to make plays and think there's always a play to be made but um, maybe learning how to manage the game and uh, you know sometimes make make nothing out of nothing rather than trying to make something out of nothing um, so I think that's you know it, it, it Took me a while to learn coming into the league as well. So, um, you know, game by game, I think we're getting better since I've been here. And, uh, you know, I think we'll we'll continue on that. Well, Adam, I appreciate your time. Thanks for catching up with us. Appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Defenseman Adam Clendenning joining us here on Ice Hawks TV. We'll be back with more. You're watching Rockford Ice Hawks Hockey on the Ice Hawks Broadcast Network.